because of the waste and the environmental impact associated with the current way of manufacturing, there is this huge demand for a much leaner, much more efficient process which can reduce the lead time as well as the emissions that are required to produce large aerospace components. These components are large structural elements and typically are machined out of solid blocks of metal or very large forgings. Uh, these are affected by extremely long lead times and up to 99% of the raw materials is removed away in the form of swarf, which can't be recycled that easily. WAMAT stands for uh, Maturation of Wire Plus R Additive Manufacturing. It's a large industry-driven consortium. Uh, which is answering the needs of companies to have a process which is capable of delivering large-scale metal additive manufacturing components. There is a group of around about 30 people working full-time in this uh, laboratory and there is a good contribution by uh, MSc students that come here to do their individual projects. It's a good practice for them to deal with the real industry problem and learn the skills that they will use in the future in their industrial placement. One of the reasons why companies like to work with Cranfield is that we've got uh, some unique piece of equipment. The one in which I am at the moment is a unique facility in the world. It's the world's largest metal 3D printer. In the last few years, we were able to reduce the material waste from the 95% that it's average today down to as little as 10%. From an industrial point of view, the benefits are huge because of the reduction in material waste. And also because these parts could be made much lighter, that means that the planes would require much less fuel, which is an additional environmental impact as well.